Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com doing our second to last break of 2017 Panini Illusions football. First inner of a fresh master case. This is break number nine. Pick your team nine. So big thank you to these folks for getting into the action right here on a Saturday. Thanks very much, everyone. Karen with that last spot mojo, Jets. And there's everyone else. Good luck to everybody. Now let's pop this master case open. There it is, your sealed case, sealed master case right there. It's cut away from me so I don't slice my fingers open, loose fingers like Jason Pierre Paul. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's roll this die right here. Let's give let's give that let's give that die a little room to roll, huh? One, two, three, four, five, six. And it's four. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this is the side we're gonna do tonight. And that'll be Pick Your Team 10, which is already in the store. And if we do it tonight, I'll give away some uh, some more break credit. In fact, at the end of this break, there's break credit. So for Illusions number nine, what did I, what did I promise here? 30 bucks. That's not bad. So uh, the name on top will get 30 bucks at the end of the uh, break with a different randomizer. And right there, points, if any, will be there. All right, good luck. All right, here we go. I forget how long this this takes. Uh, no, the next break is 41. Vertex is also $41 a break credit. Verte uh, Vertex, whatever Vertex is on jazbeeshobbyland.com right now, $41 a break credit. The second inner case of Illusions is 41 and $33 a break credit to represent the Super Bowl score. This one I had up as $30 a break credit. That illusions that box topper right up right up here. Okay, good luck, boys and girls. Thank you very much for getting into this break. Really appreciate it. Like I said, this is our second to last break. Pick your team ten is our last one. We don't have any more illusions. No mas, no more illusions. Uh, yes, we have had an auto or two in those box bottomers. Um, didn't we get a Rich Gannon autograph out of here? Or am I confusing it with another product? I'm pretty sure we got a Rich Gannon autograph. I have no idea, Joe, what a Barry McConker Legends auto is worth. I barely know who that guy is. <laughs> um, check on eBay. See what other similar ones have gone for. That's, a bit, that's how I would check. Our first hit is first impressions autograph. The Kaiser roll. Deshaun Kaiser, jersey and auto. 
Oh, it was a Ganon auto, right? Seal curtain? Okay, it was it was out of this set. Who gets the Kaiser roll? That goes to Daniel Anderson with Deshaun Kaiser. Ezekiel Elliott, Relic, for the Cowboys. That'll be for Shane and the Cowboys. Zeke, easy e Any other big football news today? I mean, I, I know that, was it today? Yes, Yesterday or today, Jimmy Garoppolo was signed to the big contract. Maybe it was today. My days are all blurring in together. Um, is there anything else going on in, in football? We're kind of in like the weird off-season zone. Or it's like the super post Super Bowl hangover, and then and then eventually we'll start getting all this draft craziness happening. There's Hassan Reddick, two thirty out of two fifty. That'll go to Arthur, and the Cardinals. Nice one, Arthur. It was yesterday. That was the Jimmy Garoppolo. Good for him, though. I mean, he he balled out and he got paid. He put himself in the best situation possible. So good for him. Uh, we got Jonu Smith out of 150 rookie endorsements autograph for the Titans. That'll be for Karen. Sean, what's going on? Sean's, both Sean's are here. They've got Boston Graph Sean and then Sean B. And we've got more Cardinals for Arthur. That's David Johnson. Healthy David Johnson and a uh, and a new quarterback. It could be pretty interesting for the Cardinals. Let's put this in the better fitting top loader, Arthur. There we go. Right. Yeah. That was a that was a very odd issue. We'll do the left-right randomizer on these. Um, Josh McDaniels, the way he backed out of that Colts job, seems like seems like he is. Uh, seems like he's poised to be the next Patriots head coach. Yeah, no, I don't think he's retiring yet, but it might not be too long. There's Jeremy Macklin out of 100. Is your box bottomer? That goes to the Ravens. That goes to Mike Thomas. Oh, it's Jeremy Macklin and Steve Smith Sr. All right, box one. Our, do we have any Colts fans in here? How do the Colts fans feel about this? Yeah, I mean. That's what you have to assume, right, Steve? Is that is that why would because the the story goes, yeah, uh, Jeremy Jeremy McNichols, no, Josh McDaniels, two different people. Josh McDaniels said that uh, he had said yes to the job. There was gonna be a press conference on Wednesday. Then he talked to the Patriots on Monday or Tuesday of the week of whenever that happened, and then said, ah, no, I changed my mind. Pretty much like the next day. And so what would make someone change their mind? I mean, it got so bad that his agent actually said, yeah, well, I'm, we're parting ways. We're done. You know, I'm dropping him as a client. The agent was pissed. He's like, hey, I'm a man of my word, you know, and, um, and now this guy makes me look bad. I'm done. I think the GM of the Colts is also that agent's client. But anyhow, you would think what would be the only reason why Josh McDaniels would would do what the agent said. This is quote the agent. I think he said this is professional suicide. Is 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 what the agent said. Something to that effect. So why would Josh McDaniels do that? It has to be because they're going to groom McDaniels for the coaching job, for the head coach job for the Patriots. That that might be. That's the only logical reason why. You know, unless unless Belichick has like, you know, has incriminating photographs of Josh McDaniels in compromising positions with a uh, a Malik Hooker. 97 out of 2, 100. Dalvin Cook, keeping it at 100. Dalvin Cook, that's a nice autograph, too. 
As far as Dalvin Cook autos go, just a little more effort there. That goes to the Vikings. That'll be for Jared. Nice, Jared. He'll be... Dalvin Cook will be back. He'll be back. So yeah, so that's the that's the drama with uh, that's the short that's the short uh, version of the drama that's involved in New England. There's uh, Marcus May, 95 out of 100, keeping it at 100 is Karen and the Jets. Last spot mojo. We've got It's like it's like he heard us talking about him. For the Colts, that goes to Steve Freeze. See if it's like he heard us talking about. Four out of fifty on that one. It's like he knew. He knew. His his ears were burning. He's like, I know you're talking about me. Bam, here I come. Boom. Lady of the night. Here I am, you know? I don't think Malik Hooker thinks that joke is funny. Um, <laughs> Ricky Williams, Alvin Kamara, Legacies, Dual Relic, 17 out of 50, both Saints, both for William L. We got Joe Mixon for the Bengals, First Impressions, Jumbo Relic. For the Bengals, Robert. <laughs> Rick's like, hey, Joe, talk about Jameis Winston now. Say Jameis Winston for me. I'm actually kind of scared if that actually works, Rick. I would have to rethink my whole life. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> That's a left-right randomizer. All right, next box. Oh, let's do this too. For the Redskins, Robert Kelly, fifty-two out of one hundred. John Riggins on the uh, in the background. Robert Kelly in the foreground. If I discovered that I could just kind of casually discuss football players, and then there uh, uh, an autograph of them would appear soon afterwards. That kind of X-Men style power would be terrifying to me. I mean, then I would think what other things would happen? You know, if I started talking about, I don't know, if I started talking about Ariana Grande when she just walked through, the, walked through the door to the store, hey, my car broke down, can I use your phone? Would that happen? I don't know, maybe, that'd be terrifying. What if I started talking about things, people that I didn't like? You know, then that would be awkward too. And it's just like, I'll, I'll be sitting here being like, oh man, if there's one one guy that really pisses me off, you know, that would be so-and-so. You know, Kevin McHale or something like that. And then Kevin McHale walks through the door. That's terrifying superpower. Terrifying superpower. Because you only think about the good stuff. You're just like, oh yeah, just, you know, talk about Ariana Grande. But then what if I'm like, what if I'm like ragging on Steve Freeze's Broncos and I just feel like, yeah, you know, I don't like, you know, I don't like so-and-so, you know, and then so-and-so walks through the door and it's like, oh man. <laughs> Brandon's like, I'd, you'd be a lucky dog if Ariana Grande walked through the door. I'd have her break... I'd have her open up a couple boxes. 150 points. So that'll be part of the, uh, it's a winner take all on points. I'd have her open up a couple boxes of illusions. Oh. New York Jets, first impressions, relic, our Darius Stewart, jersey and autograph. And that's for last bought mojo, Karen. See, is this going to, could I put this in a 100, Karen? Yeah, okay, there we go. Plus 
And then we've got Jonathan Allen for the Redskins. Michael Gallucci with the Redskins, 79 out of 100. Um, Ariana Grande, if you're watching, hi, I'm Joe. If you ever want to go out for In-N-Out and milkshakes, I'll treat. Also, it, I think the guys and, and the girls I watch too, I think would get a real kick out of uh, you opening up a couple box of Illusions football and giving us your thoughts. Open invitation to Ariana Grande. All right, 14 out of 50, Dak Prescott, Troy Aikman. <laughs> or Steve Freeze. <laughs> Steve Freeze is like, or any product, really. It wouldn't really matter. Steve says, one out of ten, John Ross and Deshaun Jackson is like, it's like Steve's just like, you know what, Joe? She doesn't even have to open up anything. She just sit down and talk to us. <laughs> or any product, really. No, it would have to be, if, if you want to get the most FaceTime with Ariana Grande, it would be like, yeah, Ariana, we've got, uh, Oh, we've got this great product. We've got a full case of Bowman Draft for you. Enjoy that Bowman Draft. Pop open six boxes of Bowman Draft Jumbo. Super Jumbo. Have fun with that. That'd be great. We've got Amir Abdullah and Barry Sanders in the background. 29 out of 100. Yeah, let's do a 12-case optic. Yeah, well, actually, Contenders Optic Football is coming out. If she accepts the invitation, we'll just have her do, like, a 12-case break of that. Oh, man, she's got a great voice, too. If she can sing her way through a break, or at least a box. I should probably pull this out, too. I'm thinking too much about Ariana Grande. Um, yeah, she could probably sing her way through a break. That'd be great. Lovely voice, easy on the eyes. You know, and it just, and she, she's actually, uh, um, she's got great comedic. If anyone has seen like the Nickelodeon shows, she's a good actor, actress. And um, if you've seen any of her SNL stuff, she actually has really good comedic timing. So I'm sure she could improv something pretty clever throughout all this. It works. All right. So Ariana, if you're listening, open invitation. And you know what, Ariana? I'm pretty sure the Jaspies gang would have a kick out of you doing this joke. It's Jake Butt, 22 out of 50. Jake Butt, he's a tight end. See, they would love that joke. That joke kills. That joke kills. And if you did a version of that joke, it would melt down the internet. Right, Karen? Karen with the Broncos. There you go, Jake, but. Jared Davis, 86 out of 100. That'll go to the Lions. William L. with the Lions. First impressions, Relic and Autograph, Samaj Piran. That goes to the Redskins and Michael Gallucci. That's right, that's that Oppo Joe Mojo with that butt. First impressions, Josh Reynolds, 3 out of 50. <laughs> Brandon's like, the only problem if, uh, if someone like that was opening cards. I don't know how much of the cards I'd be paying attention to. We'll just have her wear a big jacket or something. That's cool. 
We'll figure it out. The cards are the most important thing. We've got De Kaiser, first impressions relic, Deshaun Kaiser. That goes to the Browns out of your Daniel Anderson. We've got, don't look, Michael Gallucci. Chris Perrin, you get the 28, 28 out of 100, Ben Rothsberger and Terry Bradshaw illusions card encased. We're halfway through this inner case break. Good luck, everybody. Right, Greg? I don't know if that's the same kind of sorcery. <laughs> it could be. Could be. Mike Thomas needs a giant here. There's got to be a giant in here somewhere, right? A Wayne Gallman, a, uh, a Evan Ingram, Davis Webb, one of those guys has got to be in here. If you're lucky, maybe some old school guy. All right, good luck, everybody. This is what happens on a Saturday night. The show goes off the rails a little bit. Mac Collins, return of the Mac jersey and autograph. He is a Super Bowl champ, Mac Collins. I don't know what he did in the Super Bowl. But he is a Super Bowl champion. He'll get a ring. First impressions, Taiwan Taylor. Big relic for Karen and the Titans. Ooh. Ooh, is that a, are those laundry tags? That's a one of one. Dual relic, dual autograph. Rookie reflection, one of one. That's Corey Davis on top, Taiwan Taylor on the bottom. And that is for... That's for Karen. Some girls have all the luck. Nice, Karen. Rookie reflection. Talk about sorcery. Karen has only recently been buying the Titans. Boom. That's a beaut. That design is cool. These are the, these are the kind of cards, I'm telling you, these cards in this lighting right here because the studio lights kind of glare kind of create a bad reflection on this, but these look nicer in person. I, I assure you that. So if you're kind of not impressed by the design of it, I'm telling you, they look nicer in person. That's a beautiful one. Karen, all aboard. The Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Two laundry tags. Nice. nice. Mike Williams, Chargers. That goes to Sam and the Bolts. Sam on the board with the bolts. Sidney Jones, 003 out of 250 for the Eagles. For the Fly Eagles Fly. Super Bowl champion. I don't know what he, I don't know what this guy did in the Super Bowl. Well, now I'm curious. What are these, what did these random kids do in the Super Bowl? What did the, what did these kids do? We're going to the box score, going to the Eagles, Sidney Jones. 
Does he still get a ring? I don't think Sidney Jones is not on the stat sheet. Mac Hollins? Return of the Mac not on the stat sheet. Do they still get rings? I'm assuming they do. Of course they do. They all get rings. Like the janitor will get rings. <laughs> you know? The equipment kid. We'll get it. No, the the Eagles rookie that actually blew blew it up. That would be Corey Clement. Four receptions, 100 yards, and a TD. Not too much on the rushing department, but you might be thinking of Corey Clement, Brandon. That's like the that's like the rookie that that did that like the random rookie that kind of came out of nowhere and did work. All right, we have. Panthers, Luke Keekley, Kevin Green. Nice one for the Panthers. That'll go to Brian. Dat, what's going on? Good luck, folks. Just a few boxes to go. Um, I don't know what's full after this. I think Impeccable was getting close. Did Impeccable end up selling out? Impeccable is down to two teams left, folks. Two teams left in Impeccable Football. That's our last case of that. It's on jazbeeshobbyland.com. We've got the other half of this case right here, too. Remember, this is our last night of the week. We're off for two nights. We're dark for two nights, as they say in the in an industry. In the industry, and we're back on Tuesday, live on Tuesday. So you're gonna miss us. Hey, the what's going on? First impressions: the juice. O.J. Howard. That goes to uh, Rick and the Titans. Rick with some juice. Rookie endorsements. Jehu Chesson. 138 out of 150. Out of 150, Chiefs. That goes to Ryan, Royal for Speed. Triple Relic, that's a randomizer. Legacies, Leonard Fournette, Dalvin Cook, Christian McCaffrey. Nice trio of rookie running backs. That'll be a randomizer. Uh, no, we actually just finished the foot. Did I not upload that football mixer? Maybe I didn't. I've been all over the place today. Rookie endorsements out of 50. Matthew Days. For days and days for Daniel Anderson and the Browns. Maybe I forgot to upload it. Sorry, guys. I did. <laughs> Come on, Joe. Unbelievable. Let me upload that right now. Just, just, just slow today, folks. I'm just slow on the uptake today. perk you up. 94 out of 100, two color patch and autograph. First impressions auto, Deshaun Watson. That goes to Joe P and the Texans. Joe, wake up. Wake up, Joe. I know you have, I, I know you're listening to me. You're on the other side of the room right now. You're, you're taking care of stuff. It's all good. Joe, run back to the laptop. 
Deshaun, I've not forgotten about you. Deshaun Watson, 94 out of 100. There you go. Oh, he might be asleep. I don't know. Maybe he passed out. He was just like, I don't like hearing about Ariana Grande and went to bed. 002 out of 100, Jeremy Macklin. He's on West Coast time. I don't know why I said wake up. He's probably like doing stuff right now. Important stuff. Maybe pu putting the little one to bed or something like that. Alright. I don't know. Where's Joe P? Joe P's not here. Joe P always, uh, Joe, Joe always saying that I never pull him hits. Sad times for him. He's always hitless. The moment he steps away from the computer and out comes the Deshaun Watson, he wasn't here to see it live. Never miss a moment, folks. Just be Hobbyland. You can take it. You can put us on your phone. YouTube on your phone. You know, just take us everywhere. There's no excuse. No excuse. Just get little headphones. It's possible, Brandon. It is possible. All right, second to last box, ladies and gentlemen. Second to last box. All right, I got a few, couple randomizers to do, right? So these are your randomizers. These represent the left-right randomizers. Right, William's like, he can't leave. Every time Joe P's in a break or in the chat with me. William L always seems to pull some big hits. We've got Marcus May for the Jets out of 250 for Karen and the Jets. Last spot mojo. Strong. Kelvin Benjamin, still a Panther in this one. Uh, that goes to Brian with the Panthers. And then we've got Joe Mixon. 20 out of 25, three color patch and autograph. Who's got Joe? Robert does. Robert with the Joe Mixon. Oh, I still owe you that other thing too, Robert. I keep forgetting to draw that picture. All right. I'll get around to it eventually, someday. Patrick Mahomes. And don't look, Michael Gallucci. First impressions, 36 out of 50, two-color patch, James Conner. That goes to Chris Parent and the Steelers. Ryan Switzer, that's a catch. 43 out of 150. See, refs, I know what a catch is. That's a catch. That goes to the Cowboys, Shane with the boys. All right, last box coming up. Good luck, folks. Uh, I don't think we don't have anything filled up after this. This is true, Seal Curtain. You're, you're taken care of. 008 out of 100, Dan Fouts, Philip Rivers. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully Mrs. Michael Gallucci is not looking at the chat right now. Uh, Chargers, that goes to Sam with the Chargers in case card. He's like, excuse me, Michael, what did you say? You have a what tonight? Oh, I mean. All right. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. Remember, our last inner case break of illusions is on jazbeeshobbyland.com right now. So check it out. If we do it tonight, I'll give away a bunch of break credit. She is long asleep, says Cecile Curtin. There we go.
All right, last box. Good luck. All right, we have. Don't look, Michael. We got four out of twenty-five. Cameron Sutton for Chris Parent and the Steelers. Chris, it's Michael Gallucci that usually gets the Steelers, so and he's in the chat right now. Just trying to help him out. All right. Michael Thomas for the Saints. Mike, I don't know why you don't buy the Saints all the time for Michael Thomas. Anyhow. Mike Thomas needs Giants. This goes to uh, William. William L. Uh, don't look, Steel Curtain. Don't look. Just go to a different tab for like five sec, five like for like ten seconds, fifteen seconds. Three color patch and autograph out of one hundred are Joshua Dobbs. That goes to Chris Parent and the Steelers. Elusive Inc. LeVar Arrington from Reading Rainbow. 15 out of 25. LeVar Ball? LeVar Arrington for the Redskins, of course. Michael Gallucci with that one. Nice old school Redskin there. All right, I think that might be it. Maybe one more. Oh, we've got Jameis Winston. How about that, Rick? Cash me outside. How about that? 23 out of 25. Nice little patch in there. Looks like there's like an arrow pointing. Like, that's pretty cool. It's actually a really good looking patch. It's nice, Rick. Damn nice. 23 out of 25. Just 20 off the jersey number. That's all. We're always off on the jersey number, Rick. And that is that, folks. You're welcome, Rick. Thank you very much, everybody. Uh, you may or may not be in on a randomizer or two. Oh, let's see what that box hopper has as well. Or box bottomer. Kind of a make or break year for this guy next year, I think. It's going to be... 7 out of 50, Philip Rivers, Dan Fouts. It's another version of this going to Sam and the Chargers. There you go, Sam. A few things for you. All right. Time to do some randomizers. Oh, I don't need to randomize this. These are both Saints. All right, so I'm going to go to random.org. Let's pull up some some uh, some blank lists to randomize. One, two, th one, two, three, four. All right, so we got the left, right for all of those cards. We have the triple relic for those running backs: Jags, Vikings, Panthers, and then we've got the out of ten. That was the John Ross for the Bengals, and that was Deshaun Jackson for the Redskins. That was out of 10, nice low number on that one. Some good patches in there too. And everybody gets a shot at the points and the break credit. All right, good luck. Randomizing each list, five and a four, nine times. Left, right first, one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. That goes to the right side. So all the teams on the right side will get this style of card right here. All right, the Legacies Triple Relic featuring the three rookie running backs, Jags, Vikings, and Panthers. Once again, nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
and ninth and final time. Jaguars on top, Ed Ramos with the Legacies Triple Relic. That is out of 15, it looks like. Yeah, 15 out of 15. Leonard Fournette, Dalvin Cook, Christian McCaffrey. Nice low number. This one's out of 10. One out of 10, John Ross and Deshaun Jackson. Once again, nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Bengals. That goes to Robert Rincon with the Bengals. One out of ten. Nice little number for these two guys. There we go. And for Luge's nine, thirty dollars and points. Everybody has a shot at that. So if you got a nice hit. Could be a bonus for you. If you didn't get any hits, could be a nice consolation prize. Good luck, everybody. Once again, five and a four, nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And ninth and final time. After nine times, drum roll, drum roll, drum roll, drum roll, drum roll. Points, 150 of them going to Jeremy Cole. And the winner of 30 bucks of break credit, Jared. There you go. That's FanDuel in the room. There you have it, folks. Thanks very much, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. The next inner, our last inner of illusions. Football is in the store right now on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Right over there. So please go there, pick your teams, check it out. More break credit being given away if it breaks tonight. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.